Yeah. We have been saying that we've been gonna do this road trip in our Toyota Corolla, and then. Today is day 13 of our six month US road trip and I got my Starbucks. We are actually in Denver, Colorado still and we're planning on having a meet up today and something I just realized when I got back in the car is I can't find my phone so I don't think I brought it with me. So I'm hoping when I get back to the house it's there or else this is not a good start to my day. I just got back and look what I found. It's my phone. <laughs> I just didn't take it with me because I had it on the charger. What is going on on the bus today? Well, this is part two of mounting the propane tank. Larger than needed, this is angle iron. Me and Kyle yesterday flipped around like a um, like a crossbar kind of thing, cross beam. So we're gonna put one like this, one like this, and then this propane tank right in here. See how it has those little lips on the side there? Yeah. So then that's gonna sit flat oh. from front to back. Yeah. It rained so hard this morning and I'm surprised that this paint is still here. But this is a painting that I did on Reed's bus yesterday. I painted the mountains. Caitlin and Mia painted Colorado flag. But thankfully it stopped raining. The sun is coming out and it is turning into a beautiful day. Bro, it is so cold outside today. It is a gloomy, kind of rainy, Denver day. Babe, where'd you go? Oh. With who? Kyle. Oh, gosh. <laughs> Excuse me, I'm on the phone. That is hilarious. We've been here for a few days, and yesterday Reed told us that this was an actual payphone booth. We've been here for a few days, and I just thought it was a closet, and I never actually looked inside of it to see that it's just a phone booth. It's not a closet at all. If you plug that phone in, it will also actually work. Isn't that crazy? What is this called? A flannel. Flannel, I'm wearing a flannel with a jacket over it. I don't know <laughs> if that's acceptable or not, but I don't really care about fashion rules. So I just kind of do whatever I want. Life is crazy, you guys. <laughs> Dude, this Insane. This vehicle's legit. Have we told them the news? I don't think, I, I think we maybe hinted at it a little bit. I I've, mean, like it kind of was obvious. I built the plan. bed in the back of the Suburban. So we're gonna be changing vehicles. Yeah. We have been saying that we've been gonna do this road trip in our Toyota Corolla and then the guy's house that we're staying at, he is just such an awesome guy. He's actually gonna be living out of that bus right there. And he got this Suburban for really cheap, but it's like in great condition. And he's like, no, you guys are not traveling in your car. You need more room, you're taking my Suburban. So Kyle built this bed in it yesterday, this platform. The mattress is coming in like three days. But let's just show you guys some of the features of this thing. <laughs> First of all, it is so comfortable. Like yeah, it's like real. broken in like a like a nice couch that's been at the house for a while and it's just like good to go. We got heated seats. That is gonna be perfect, oh my gosh. And then Kyle just blew my mind with this, but unfortunately we weren't vlogging when he showed me. So, show us. Settings for two people. McKenna and I are total opposites. I'm six foot, she's five two, so whenever we get in the car, I'm like, and then we swap out, she's like, I can't reach. So, we always have to like readjust and sit there, and now it's just literally like, you push a button. Show me. And it works. Well, I was gonna get mine set to what I wanted. Oh, gotcha. I just added a ton of lower back support. Dude. Just set number one to my settings. Wait, so. why are you gonna be number one? I don't know. Cause I was the first one to set it. <laughs> okay. All you do is adjust it to like whatever you want, like however you want it set. Bruh. Yo, Chevy. Make some nice cars, not gonna lie. This thing is super comfy. And then I'll be like, oh yeah, just let me go back to my setting. You want to start switching stuff from our car in here? Yes. Let's do that right now. From our Corolla to the Chevy Suburban. This is going to be so much more spacious. And we already have our Got Love decal on there. Have it on the back. Also, this is Mr. White, by the way. Reed named the Suburban Mr. White. So we will continue to call it that. Oh, Kyle's teaching kind of maintenance head, stuff so over here. Super hard. Yeah.
Holy moly, that is very slow. That is much slower than I was going. Yeah, so it's gonna take a while. Yeah. But if you can get like in a position. <laughs> yep. And I'm guessing you drilled a lot of steel in the uh, Air Force? Yes. Yeah, our car is packed. This is our bed platform that Kyle built yesterday so we can put storage underneath. And he also made it to be able to, if I can lift it myself, yeah, lift up. That way we can set stuff in there if things don't just slide underneath. Wow, the changes that are happening. So this is the car before. Not too bad in here right now because we have a lot of stuff inside. Oh my gosh, it will. Yes, empty. That's it. Everything is out of our car. Oh no. What is this? It's like a rain snow. Oh, Frosty's coming to town. Ah. It's not even snow. It's like. Yeah, it is snow. Look at that. Holy crap, look how big that one is. <laughs> oh, they're raindrops that are like goodness. frozen. That's what they're, snow is. No, 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 but they're like raindrops. They're not snowflakes. So that means they're like freezing, <laughs> like barely. Look. Just like little balls. Oh yeah, they're like little mini hail pieces. Yeah, they're, it's just raindrops that are frozen, not actual snowflakes. Oh my gosh. This is like barely melting in my hand even. Oh my gosh. You guys, the pizza's here. I am starving right now. Reed told us to get pizza from Garlic Knot, so that's what we did. We've heard good things, but it's gonna be amazing. We're having a meetup right now. We have a couple people over here. Tammy, Austin, Katie, Kyle, Alex. Yep. Yes! Okay, you guys can totally come over and get food because that's what I'm about to do. Are you breaking out the Cards Against Humanity? <laughs> Grandma! <laughs> I get by with a little help from you. It is 10.30. Everybody's pretty much left. We got these three We had a dance here. party. We did. Hey. It's all on Instagram and Snapchat and That's all that. Right. Right. It was fun. <laughs> all the content. <sighs> I'm worn out, Blue. You are so tired. <laughs> It was a good time though. We had a really good turnout of people. And then we pretty much just like, I was like, I don't know what to do at meetups. We watched some videos, we played some games. You guys should comment down below. What What do you think we should do yeah. for meetups? Like when you this one we have at a house. So we like watch some YouTube, we play some yeah. games. If you were to come to a meetup and like meet us, like what would you expect, you know? Let us know, but it was fun. Tomorrow, we're going out to adventure and explore Denver finally. It's gonna be great. Time. So stay tuned for that. If you're not subscribed, be sure to hit that subscribe button. We'll see you guys in our next video. Peace, Peace out. out. Go, go, go. go. go.